Olivia from Hopeful Honey here. Today we're learning how to crochet the UK treble crochet. Before you begin, you'll need to crochet a foundation chain to a desired length plus two extra chains. So to begin, skip three chains. This counts as your first treble crochet of row one. And crochet one treble crochet in the fourth chain from your hook. So to begin, yarn over once and insert your hook in that fourth chain. And yarn over and pull back through. You should have three loops on your crochet hook. Yarn over and pull through those first two loops. Two loops left on your crochet hook. Yarn over and pull through both of those loops as well. There you go, your first treble crochet. Let's try another one in that next stitch, shall we? So remember, yarn over. Insert your hook in that next chain, yarn over and pull back through. You should have three loops on your crochet hook. Yarn over and pull through the first two loops. Two loops left. Yarn over and pull through the last two loops. So continue crocheting one treble crochet in every chain all the way across to reach the end of row one. Once you reach the end of row one, chain two. So one, two, then turn your work so you're crocheting in the opposite direction. So the chain two counts as the first treble crochet of this row. Now crochet your next treble crochet in the following stitch. So yarn over and insert your hook in that next stitch. Yarn over and pull back through. Three loops on your crochet hook. Yarn over, pull through two loops. Two loops left. Yarn over and pull through the last two loops. There you go. Let's try it again in that next stitch, this time with a close-up. So remember, yarn over once. Then insert your hook in that next stitch. Yarn over and pull back through that stitch. Three loops on your crochet hook. Yarn over and pull through two loops leaving you with two loops on your crochet hook. Yarn over and pull through those last two loops. There you go, it just takes a tiny bit of practice. So continue crocheting one treble crochet in every stitch all the way across to reach the end of row two. Once you reach the end of row two, continue repeating row two until you reach your desired length. The treble crochet is one of the most versatile yet common crochet stitches. This stitch is about twice as tall as a double crochet and creates a fairly dense but not stiff fabric, perfect for those cozy sweaters, scarves and afghans we all know and love. You can easily combine the treble crochet with many other stitches to produce dozens of interesting patterns and textures. Be sure to check out my blog, hopefulhoney.com, for lots of free crochet patterns. If you enjoyed this tutorial, please thumbs it up, share and subscribe.